let's see, I'd call that 23 below zero. Yeah, 23 below zero. I don't know if that's better than anybody else, but I'd say 23 below zero is pretty darn cold. So let's go see if the bike will start. Beginning mileage, 4, 4, 3, 1, 5, 1, 4. Okay, we're going to do some crazy D style riding on the packed snow. This is not going to be a long ride, but it will... Crazy D style riding on the packed snow. This is not going to be a long ride, but it will. That's why. Helps if you have it in neutral. Not as easy as Crazy D makes it look like. And part of it is because my front tire is not turning. I think that's what it is. I bet you my front bearing is froze up. That was what the problem was. I need to heat that front tire up a little bit.
Okay. The ice off the front here and see if you can see this 43151.5 43151.5 went a total of two blocks with the front tire skidding and back but maybe it counts I think I was out for three minutes at least if not more okay so I got back checked out Put some heat right there. That's the back part of the piston to the caliper. Put some heat to it. Now, tire turns nice and easy. No problem. So, it wasn't the bearings. It was the caliper freezing up from the cold. But I guess at 23 below zero, what can you expect? But now it's nice and spinning free. So, guess next right if I do it at 20 below zero, I'll... Uh, Heat up the garage enough to make sure the caliper comes unstuck and unfrozen. Be a lot better than skiing down the road with a stuck tire.